Hello everyone. Welcome to MS Active webcast. In this video, we are going to see the steps to convert existing user mailbox into shared mailbox in Exchange 2019. A shared mailbox is one type of mailbox in Exchange 2019 that allows access of a single mailbox to multiple users to read and send email messages. The associated Active Directory user account of the shared mailbox is disabled. And that's why we can't log into a shared mailbox directly. In this guide, we want to convert our existing user mailbox into shared mailbox. But before we do that, let's verify our existing user mailbox in Exchange Admin Center. I'm going to open Internet Explorer and then I'm going to type https colon double slash localhost slash ecp to access Exchange Admin Center. Click on More Information and click on go on to the web page. Sign in as an administrator or with the password. On the Exchange Admin Center web interface, we need to click on recipients and then after we need to click on mailboxes tab. Here we can see the existing user mailbox with the name Bhavin Vyas. And as you can see, mailbox type is user. We want to convert this user mailbox into shared mailbox. Let me click on shared tab. And here we can see the existing shared mailbox on our exchange. We have only one shared mailbox with the name general information. So we want to convert this user mailbox into shared mailbox. And for that, we need to use exchange management shell. So let's open exchange management shell. Let me maximize it. Let's clear the screen. Uh, we will use set hyphen mailbox cmd late to convert regular user mailbox into shared mailbox. Then we need to specify switch hyphen identity and here we need to specify the name of our user mailbox which is Bavin Vyas in our case and then we need to specify switch hyphen type and it is going to be a shared. So our full CM delete will be set hyphen mailbox hyphen identity bavin vias hyphen type shared. Now we need to press enter key. Okay, the CM delete is completed successfully. Let's verify the type of our recipient using the CM delete get hyphen mailbox. So our CM delete will be get hyphen mailbox space hyphen identity bavin vias format list name and recipient type details. Let's press enter key. And as you can see recipient type details is shared mailbox. That means we have successfully converted our existing user mailbox into shared mailbox. We also want to verify the same thing using Exchange Admin Center as well. So let's go back to the, our Internet Explorer. And first of all, I'm going to click on refresh button. And here we can see now we don't have the user mailbox with the name Bavin Vyas. Let me click on shared tab and let's click on refresh icon again. And here we can see here we have uh, our mailbox with the name Bavin Vyas. Now this mailbox is converted into shared mailbox. Let's select the shared mailbox and I'm going to click on edit icon. Let's click on Mailbox Delegation. Under Full Access, I'm going to click on this plus sign to add a delegate. I'm going to select Bharat Sarma and uh, Sagasa. Click on Add. Click on OK. And I'm going to do the same for Sanders Permission as well. Let's select Bharat Sama and Sagar Sah. Perfect. After configuring the mailbox delegation permissions, now our users Bharat Sama and Sagar Sah can read and send messages using this shared mailbox. Now I'm going to click on save button to save these changes. One more thing which we want to verify is the state of the associated user account Bavin Vyas in Active Directory. So let's go back to the SOW Manager console, click on Tools and click on Active Directory Users and Computers. 
and here we can verify the state of our user Pavin Vyas and now it is converted into disabled. The reason is pretty simple one because the associated account of the shared mailbox will be always disabled so no one can directly access this shared mailbox. In this way we can convert a regular user mailbox to a shared mailbox using the exchange management shell as well as we can use exchange admin center to configure the mailbox delegation permission as well. That's all for this video. Thank you all for watching this video. Have a nice day.